All right, so quickly, I'll just uh, read down my notes for you. Like I, I like the Mellotron they were using. That's a very classic uh, uh, sound in a lot of prog. Going back to the classic prog, the Mellotron sounds. When his voice hit the uh, hit my ears, it was quite comfortable to listen to. Very nice voice. He's got a great voice. He has a very uh, clean, clear voice really nice a higher range and it really does sing and fit in well with the band and the singing and the, the way it's all layered and mixed it sounds very nice and cohesive there is a, a lot i was thinking these guys have tons of chords in their pockets they keep pulling them out <laughs> you know just when i i thought i caught on to the chord pattern suddenly there's more chords and then there's more chords and they keep pulling them out all these neat neat twists and turns uh, as far as chording and they have chords to spare. That's one of the reasons I love progressive rock is because um, I can't be satisfied with uh, simplicity all the time. I need to have some complexity. I need to be challenged. So there were sort of a hints of Genesis and I have heard a little bit of Marillion so I thought it kind of seemed sort of in that genre or that kind of branch of Genesis, Marillion-ish kind of sounds a bit there. And also remind me a little of uh, of a Quebec band here in Canada, we have a band called Mystery, in, in Quebec, and I downloaded one of their albums uh, off of iTunes years ago. I guess chords play an important part. You could say that, you know, some some prog is very riff oriented. Some is uh, a lot of its melody is pretty key, and some chords are really key. And I'd I'd say uh, Mystery is one of those bands, and probably. Marillion, uh, although I have to listen to more Marillion, I can't comment too much on Marillion. I'm going to be reacting to more of their stuff. So right at the end there, there was the cool progression of the E, G, C, B flat. Oh, okay, so the beginning was, I just discovered, is that was the same progression. But they could do this cool thing, they go down. See how they kind of changed it so now the emphasis is on a different beat? That's really clever. It's a nice turn. And then there's a quiet part, it's like an E minor and a A. Something like that. Yeah, the keyboard riff is really cool. I'm just trying to figure it out. It's, it's like this. That's what the keyboard was kind of playing in the middle part there. So anyways, some really nice stuff. I really enjoyed that song. Thanks again for, re for requesting it. And, um, and uh, if you join Patreon, you know, it's for as little as three months, three bucks a month, you'll get your requests answered more than, well, sooner than having to wait five or six months. Muse Muser, so consider it. And anyone else too who wants to get their requests up faster. And that, that goes for guitar songs as well, uh, guitar lessons as well. Okay, talk to you all later. Bye.